President Trump's veteran victory dream team will bring home the goal. For those who deserve it the most, SWIFT, Veterans Renewable Energy Jobs, will receive, beginning, $42 hourly, upwards to $168,000 annually. Mission Statement. We seek to bring more Americans off the sidelines and into the workforce by improving jobs, data transparency, and skills-based hiring and training, advancing opportunities for lifelong learning, and promoting multiple pathways to family-sustaining careers. Awesome mission statement. Now, to way to success in achieving that, you need a foundational plan, a nationwide plan that will provide the education and understanding the skills that are needed to sustain success for our veterans. SWIFT Veterans Plan. SWIFT standing for Solar Wind International Facilities Technology. Building portable renewable energy facilities. Buildings into homes schools, offices, emergency medical units, and portable farms, and establishing these fillers throughout the nation and building communities on both sides of the border. The migrants that are flooding into the nation desperately needing a way of life will learn that way of life from our veterans, teaching on both sides of the border and building these Sarah centers these homes, schools, offices, emergency medical units, portable farms, into communities for the residents that are coming into the nation. Most will stay on the other side because they will have a new career that will be established by the veterans. Everyone must know, anyone who has value in their life must have value in what they're doing to sustain that life and a desire to live that life. We must give them a desire to live. This will provide the encouragement and the life-sustaining goals and happiness within their life because they have that value given it to others. Much too long, our veterans have built nations, nation building, internationally. They're the perfect candidates to do this noble job and provide them the lion's share of the employment throughout the nation. Also, throughout the international community with the refugees that are displaced from their home worldwide, desperately needing a home, a school, an office, an emergency medical unit, a portable farm to provide for their families, to teach their children, to give them a new lease on life. Within the green zones that are established by our administration and other nations throughout the Middle East, as well as Africa, our veterans will show the way and teach and educate the vast majority of the population that is in so desperate need now of shelter, of food, clothes, shelter, emergency, first aid, and of course give them the jobs that they need building these facilities. Within our own nation we have the SWIFT Act Plan. Act Arizona, California, Texas. The border lines where on both sides of the border the Sarab Center communities will be built. Again, portable renewable energy facilities for citizens on both sides of the border. We believe and know a systematic program nationwide will do this. Earlier, the DOJ, Department of Justice, had 12 crisis cities within our own nation that is desperately needing jobs 
and education because of all of the higher crime rates throughout the cities and states of these crisis areas. The veterans are the perfect candidates to help the citizens within these areas, establishing the programs that will set up these facilities where you will have the police department, fire department, search and rescue team, FEMA, Homeland Security, the CDC, all in one area to give the citizens the understanding of what they need. But first, they have to be built. They will be built by the veterans, as well as the citizens within those areas, learning these new skills. SWIFT, Solar, Wind, International Facilities Technology. We will bring this online this year, and it will be paid for within the nation of building. No need for legislation, frustration, to up and down vote anything in or out. The Homeland Security and the 22 agencies within need backup facilities right now to provide for their standing structures that might come under threat at any time, whether it's an unnatural or a natural disaster or chemical disaster or nuclear threat. You need a backup facility, a portable renewable energy facilities that will be built by the veterans as well as the higher learning education students, the USC, University Saves Country Program. This is the solution. And not just with the Homeland Security agencies, but our military. The aging structures within all of the bases throughout the nation need to have new homes, schools, offices, emergency <laughs> medical units, portable farms within these bases. And not just the bases within the nation, but the bases throughout the entire international community. Now, the plan is to begin to sell these facilities directly to them and utilize the profits to begin the entire program, again, without any outside funding to the SWIFT Veteran Plan. It will run and provide and sustain itself by the veterans working within. We are looking forward to working with all of the members of the veterans team, and we believe that success this year will be victory for our veterans, again, bringing them the goal.